Hi everybody, I'm Henry of BlueHeronArts.com. Now I'm going to show you the process of carving a lamb chop uh, for Anna Thornton in England, uh, in UK. And uh, uh, here's the seal that uh, she picked. It's a pottery seal. And uh, I have this design made on the computer. Um, to show her before we carve, so she got a, a, I got approval from her now, uh, so I transferred it um, with the toner printer. We got to use a Xerox, Xerox machine or toner printer to make a black and white copy, and then I wrapped it on the uh, seal and used this liquid called the acetone nail polish remover. And I use a scrubber. Um, it dries in 10 seconds. And now I'm ready to to have a, an imprint on, on the pottery seal. You can see this is a very different uh, kind of material. It's made of uh, clay. It's already fired, um, so it's kind of uh, um, hard, but not as uh, Hard as a stone. It's an environmentally, friend, environmentally friendly material. Um, it's made of earth, actually. Uh, so you can uh, find this on our website. It's glazed with a very nice turquoise color glaze and decorated with the pottery bees. Uh, to protect the stone, we use a special tool called the seal bed. You can also find this on our website. It's a very convenient tool. Especially with the seal that has uh, a decoration on the other end on the top of the stone or the seal so you can protect it from the damaging uh, when you carve and it also gives you a very firm stable uh, working condition you know to to carve so you don't you won't move I use a large knife to carve the marginal area to test it's kind of different you can see we carve in a uh, what they call grid seal script which is uh, the earliest bronze ware uh, we found in the Shang and Zhou dynasty uh, it's older than the Han, actually, than the Han seal script. Um, it's more cryptographic. It says the seal of uh, Anna. This character I'm working on is uh, the character Zhi in Chinese, uh, meaning off. I like the natural chipping to create a very natural antique look suitable for this uh, material, the seal, uh, pottery clay uh, seal. Actually, in ancient times, the pottery seal uh, is also found on, on the pottery. Uh, it's, it's, they put uh, the pottery marks on the bottom of the pottery, and uh, you can make a you know, rubbing out of it, it's similar to this kind of uh, script style, script script style.
skirt, uh, the fur, uh, actually uh, could be the Chinese uh, family name, meaning uh, peace and Anna is a very common English name and we have a standard translation you can find on Google language tools. Just put in Anna, you'll get this Anna in the Chinese characters. It's like a lady sitting under a roof. I like the random uh, kind of effect I got from the imprint, you know, from the laser you know, the, uh, transfer. Uh, some part you just missed and, uh, you know, it's natural. So I just uh, do it to resolve that line. Uh, you see this corner, it was uh, closed, but uh, on this printout it's missing. I like that effect. So the four margins has, don't have to be complete or equal. You know, it could be broken, just like uh, the old uh, seal, antique. I basic idea is the uh, the taste of antiquity. You know, the uh, aesthetics of antiquity. The vital the ancient uh, objects or relics. The older, the better. I was trained as an archaeologist, and that's why I like this form of art. Uh, makes me not only to study ancient uh, culture, but also recreate, um, create a new according to inspirations from the ancient uh, culture. It takes years of uh, training to be an archaeologist and uh, you know to be able to read and write ancient uh, script. It's like a learning second foreign language. Kind of hard to turn on this wood base, but uh, that's uh, okay. With you know, we have to protect this uh, treasurable stone. I mean, the pottery seal. I usually hold it in hand. Let me change to a larger knife. And I do these large areas. I 
And also I like the door blade on this to create the kind of also in a natural cut. Not too sharp. To make the strokes round. It's not just three dimensional, it's like a relief. There's a slope. Actually, if you press, the stroke becomes thicker. If you press uh, less, it will be thinner. That's the kind of uh, surface. It's different from rubber thing. Much better if I can hold it still like uh, Thank you. 
working on this uh, complicated way, this knot uh, uh, or just, you know, like pretty girl is a comma in girl's name, especially foreign names. No, means uh, that in Chinese with a uh, ghost radical becomes the name that go. Some uh, uh, 
polishing fine cream and uh, the margin um, the margin as I mentioned earlier uh, is very important part of the design and uh, when you have the four uh, large I mean white uh, thick margins uh, you don't have you, you should arrange it according to the balance uh, on the composition the uh, margin on the uh, dense part the with more strokes it should be narrower and the uh, sparse part side on the sparse side should be uh, wider or thicker to balance the weight it's a principle and uh, usually I have to put the bottom uh, more heavier than the uh, upper part Top line. So and the corner is rounded already, so I don't have to do much. I'm using a tiny, the smallest uh, knife to do this uh, little holes or dots. Also use this for fine tuning to get into the small areas. There's a one dot right here. If you're a beginner, you can use a small knife and do it uh, little by little, but uh, uh, when you get more experience, the large knife feels more comfortable. So we have a set of uh, three different sizes. Uh, if you want to try, you can get a set of a small, medium and large knife, <coughs> similar to, to this. So I have different sizes, all three, when I do a large seal.
It's all useful. I'm going to dust it and uh, do a test imprint next. I have got uh, a um, relatively inexpensive uh, seal pad for testing purposes. You can use this. For students, you may also get this one, it's much less expensive. You can see it's a uh, fabric, so it will not stick on the stone. Okay, where is my... now we have this uh, rubber sealed uh, stamping pad, very useful for 